Good morning, everyone. How are we doing today? going on so far this morning. Trevor's actually gotten to work, which is good. But the roads are supposed to get a little bit more uh, severe up here in Ontario, Canada. I've got to do my hair, so... And there we go. All done. This is the next bit. You guys don't want to see, so I'll see you guys downstairs. So this morning I actually got up early, uh, thanks to little mister. There he is. Cool, cool. Just got off the phone with Toronto, actually with our uh, head company that we are affiliated with uh, for filming. Anyway, so it seems like though that they want to be with us actually on the 2nd of April down in Milton, Ontario, right where we're going to be filming. Um, so we actually have to send them a letter, sort of... Uh, indicate where, where we're going to be and everything else and while Trevor's actually at work I've actually made up tonight's dinner don't know if you guys can see that but shepherd's pie I, we're going to be having tonight for dinner so I got to cook it for three hours um little man is nice and relaxing let's go and find him are you relaxed buddy hey buddy are you relaxed? And I checked the mail. We have a friggin' sign out there that says no junk mail. Like, what are they, stupid? We actually got mail um, from Canada Post, but it's junk mail. Like, uh, duh, like Canada Post. Get a clue, look at the signs, instead of worrying about your own business. People want junk mail and people don't want junk mail. We don't want junk mail. It's the only waste of paper. Hello? If we want truck mail, all we have to do is go actually on the line. Sorry, go on the internet and actually look. So. But yes. Um, Trevor's right now going through the letter that we got to send down to Toronto. Proofread it. Just double check. And that way is awesome. But anyways, I'll see you in a bit. Hey everybody, it's been a while since you've seen me on the blog. Um, just wanted to do a vlog today because on... The weekend we didn't get much time to do the vlog, we were a little bit busy and stuff. Um, it was also a long weekend here for us here up in Canada because we had our what they call the family day weekend and we get a day off in uh, February as opposed to we didn't in the past um, when they did um, not have that holiday. So it's nice to actually have a little break in the winter and not have to wait till March break and stuff. So we get a family day holiday when the U.S. had their President's Day holiday this past weekend on the same day. So uh, that's what we did. Um, basically during the long weekend we were just doing some stuff around the house, trying to work on our latest video for Very Paranormal. And doing that stuff, we took a break on Monday. We actually went down to the casino to have a little bit of fun and try to win some money at the same time. And we did actually mark one about uh, Forty-seven dollars on one of the slot machines, so that was great. We actually made some money back. So we're done there. Did that. We went to actually the Bradford Casino. Uh, the Bradford Casino is the closest one to us, so we went down and checked that out. Uh, later on, we might check out another one because we kind of like doing that now. Uh, it's kind of fun. So uh, we also stopped by a friend's house on uh, Monday as well. I visited with her. Uh, she lives in. Paris, Ontario, so we stopped by her house and visited for about an hour or so on the way home. So that was fun. Then it started freezing rain, so we had a careful drive home back to Cambridge and went for dinner after that. So we stopped at Bosch the Pizza on the way home, one of our favorite spots. Uh, otherwise, Mark has been busy editing some video and stuff at home. Um, we did get some good news though. We got into another location for Very Paranormal that we're going to be filming at. And it's very close to us, so we don't have to travel for this one, which is great because I don't like traveling to the far locations. 
and we actually get to go to the one that's uh, located just outside of Toronto in Milton. So they said yes, and we get to go do that place in April. Uh, we're going to have some of our friends come with us and help us because it's a larger location. It's um, an old uh, pioneer village type thing, so we're going to check out one of the houses that's supposed to be haunted there. And we'll be filming for that. We'll also do some vlogs from there as well. And our friends Wanda and the lady from Paris that we stopped saw on Monday, she's going to come out and help us with that one also. So we'll have some backup help for that one. And some other good news we can't quite talk about yet. Um, but we are speaking with the producers of Very Paranormal and we've got some good news coming. So we'll be able to update you on that later on once we find out some more details. Um, otherwise, I was busy working on Monday so I didn't get to do much of a vlog, so this one's a little bit longer. Anyways, um, I've been busy also updating, I want to mention, a lot on our Twitter channel and our website. I'm trying to get some more traffic going through there. So if you know anybody that wants to check out our stuff, please share our Twitter and our Facebook link. I'm updating Twitter every single day, so if you want to follow us, just go search for OGPS Filming and you will see us on there. So we'll check you guys out later. Well, morning everyone. How are we doing today? Um, <clears throat> got up this morning, got a message actually from one of my former bosses, which is pretty cool. Um, she's been an awesome former boss of mine. One of the bosses I got along with, the reason why I left the company that, that this person is actually at, is because of one of the other bosses. She's, she criticizes people, um, she judges people the wrong way, and also those, well we were actually over in the store over the weekend, her and another boss actually kind of treated us like though that we were going in there to shoplift. Um, <clears throat> so what I did though is actually sent a letter in to the corporate office, basically indicating exactly of how we were treated, how wrongful that, but I'm actually doing the laundry again today. I looked at the laundry hamper, it was completely packed up. So yeah, that's what I'm doing. But I just wish people would realize though that if people are not to do with your religion or cult, um, anyways, though, is the let, don't judge people. The reason was because people are judging you back. So, yes, it's actually just entering the spin cycle, which is good for the laundry. Um, again, though, is people have got to learn not to be judging people. But I, I could keep on ranting and raving about certain things, but I don't want to because that's negative energy. I'd rather actually have a happy day. Sun is out, which is good. I'm happy about that. It's supposed to get warmer, hopefully by the end, by the end of this week. Today is Thursday. Okay, two gay guys that go out and get groceries, and what happens is we have to do a turn around, come back home. The reason why is because they actually do something which is so stupid. You need a friggin' quarter. That's a quarter. Yeah, you need a quarter for a shopping cart, which the vehicle, which service vehicle doesn't even have. So we had to run back. Whoa, can't see ya. Anyway, so I had to run back here and I should grab a quarter so that way we can get groceries. Can we say duh? Not always organized? Of course not. 